everyone. I hope you guys are having a fantastic week. So I just got off of work and after work I went to the UPS office to pick up two packages. So excuse my appearance, but yeah, I just got off of work, but anyway. So I just wanted to come on and do a reveal of my two packages that I picked up. So these are the boxes. They both look like this. And I had absolutely no intentions of really buying this at the moment. I did want it, but I was going to wait until December when their website restocked. But a great opportunity came up, you know, before then, just last week. So, of course, I had to jump on it. And I ended up purchasing two of them. So, let's open it and show you what I got. <laughs> so excited um you saw my last video it's from the same company and these are really hard to get and hard to see in person so of course i had to order them online i've never seen it in person so this is going to be a big reveal and i hope i like them because since i've never seen them in person i don't really know the sizing what it actually looks like or any of that it's really hard to find these just in a store or find them period online or anywhere let's open it so it's wrapped in this dust bag it's the same one like before like this burlap type of cotton dust bag and it says the name of the brand on the front, Mansour Gabrielle in like peachy, peach, pinkish color writing. So let's open it. I'm so excited because I haven't seen this. Ooh, it's so pretty. All right, so this is what I got. I got the Mansour Gabrielle tote bag, and this is the large size. So they only had the large size on their site. I thought it would maybe be too big and just looking at the website and their dimensions, it's still really hard to figure out how big the bag is, what it'll look like. Um, I don't know. So I just went on a whim and a prayer and hoped I would like it, hope it wouldn't be too big. But I absolutely love the size. I think it's perfect. It's not too big. I thought it would be bigger, but it's a really, really nice size. So originally I wanted, like I showed in my last video, I wanted the black. Well, I wanted this bucket bag in this color. So I wanted the bucket bag to be black in exterior with this cobalt blue lining. But this was the one that was available. I do love the red, but for some reason I just wanted it to be different. And I wanted to get the black with the blue. But that wasn't um, available, so I ended up getting red, which I still love. But this one is the royal blue, and it's black on the exterior. It's made out of vegetable leather, so the leather is really, you know, a bit stiff, and it smells wonderful. It has this wonderful coated interior. So let's take out the stuffing. It has these tags that say the name of the company on it, Mansour Gabriel. This is the style and the color on the back. It says black and royal, and it also has the dimensions on it, which are 11.5 inches across. I'm sorry. It is 11.5 inches high and 19.5 inches across and then six inches in diameter across this way so i think it's a great size again this company was made by two designers that came together and their design is based on minimalist design so 
you know, this bag has no hardware, no buckles, no zippers, no anything. So that's why it's less expensive than the current luxury brands that are out right now. It just has Mansoor Gabrielle written in gold writing. And it also comes attached with this pouch that says Mansoor Gabrielle in gold writing right there. And it has a zipper and the zipper, I'm sorry, and the interior is the same color as the bag itself. So this has this beautiful royal blue color also. And this is detachable, so you can take this out. It's very practical for putting extra things in and, you know, taking it out, going into the store or whatever, or carrying this by itself. So the only thing on the inside is absolutely nothing, just this beautiful blue color. There's no pockets inside or anything. Just looks like that. So I'll have to do a, you know, another video going into further detail. The only thing it has in here is this Made in Italy tag right there at the bottom. And that's basically it. I absolutely love it, love the color. So let's get on to the next box really quickly. So the next box came in, you know, the same packaging and all that. So let's see. So I didn't intend on buying two of these. I originally purchased one. When I came across uh, that it was available, I saw it on Instagram and they said they had 30% off. So of course that attracted me even more. And like I said, since these bags are so hard to get, I decided to jump on it. And I didn't actually get the 30% off. I still might try to. That's a whole different story. I'll have to tell you about it later. But anyway, um, so I contacted the company, said the coupon code for the 30% off wasn't working. They sent me another one, and that didn't work either. So while trying to put in the new code, I saw this color pop up. So I just put this one in to see if it would work on this bag also. And it still didn't work the new code so anyway let's open this one really quick and it's wrapped the same way with the same dust bag that says Mansoor Gabrielle on it and this is what I purchased so this is the original color that I wanted. So I wanted the bucket bag to have the royal blue lining. And then I wanted the tote bag with the red lining. So, it's so pretty. <laughs> anyway, that's it. Same design, same just big open pits. Nothing inside, no pockets, no zippers or anything just says made in Italy same thing same adjustable I mean detachable pouch it says Mansoor Gabrielle in gold and this one of course since this has the beautiful red lining this pouch has also the same color beautiful red lining on the inside and um, like I said I'll have to do a video uh, comparing the sizes, um, showing modeling shots because it's really hard to figure out online. Just looking at pictures, I couldn't figure out the sizes no matter what, no matter how much I measured and measured it against something else. So I will do that later. Um, just for comparison, like a quick comparison, I'll show you. Um, this is my Never Full MM. And this is the large tote bag. And then, I don't know, it's actually about, it looks about the same size 
as far as the width and the height. This is the GM size that I have and the Neverfull. And the Neverfull is a little bit bigger or it's a little bit wider, if you can see that. So I'll do a further, you know, more in depth video. This is another Chanel tote that I have. And I don't know, this one's about the same. As far as the width goes, the Mansour Gabrielle tote is a little bit longer. But anyway, so they are restocking these on their website, which I'll put the information below in December. So I will be stocking their website because I may want a smaller tote. And they're also coming out with these bags in a different type of leather. So this one is vegetable leather. And then they're also coming out with one in calf leather, which is softer. And they come in different colors, like royal blue, red, pink, white, uh, a lot of different colors. And you can, you know, get these. Only looks like the vegetable leather have the ones with the different contrasting colored lining. And the calf leather that's a little bit more expensive it's about two hundred dollars more expensive than this vegetable leather but the calf leather doesn't have a different color interior so like if you got a royal blue bag the interior would also be royal blue or if you got a red one it would the whole thing would be red etc etc so anyway that is my quick video just to reveal and like I said I'll do a further video a more in-depth video later these are my two beautiful new totes I love them now I have to decide which one I'm gonna keep um, I don't know probably the blue one and I will uh, I don't know give the other one to some nice purse fiend <laughs> or purse lover like myself because I have the red interior tote bag so this one will be different but we'll see it's really tempting to keep both of them but that would be crazy right anyway thank you guys so much for watching i'll be back with another video and i'll see you guys next time bye